Welcome to North Carolina Weekend. I'm Deborah Holt Noel. With all the big box superstores around, it's hard for the small independently owned businesses to compete. But one Chatham County business has kept pace and rolled with the punches since 1935. It's the J.R. Moore and Son store in Gulf. And their motto is a country store with a little bit of everything. Producer Derek Long checked it out and decided if they don't have it at J.R. Moore and Son, you probably don't need it. At one time, the community of Gulf near Sanford was a thriving place. There was uh, several stores here at one time, a hotel, bank, doctor's office. Uh, we had it all uh, for a small community. Gulf is a, a neat area. It's uh, got a lot of history, and I'm a big history buff. And um, it should have been a big happening place, but it missed out. We had three plants closed down, a tree sewing and brick making and a terracotta uh, pipe uh, manufacturer. Uh, they've all got left here now. But the J.R. Moore & Son General Store still remains to serve the community. In 1935, Mr. J.R. Moore and his son Richard started the business, and it was a truck that went around delivering out to the farms whatever supplies they needed. And eventually, that gave way to just the store. I worked here as a kid in high school. So my dad came as a partner with him then in 1968. In 1978, Mr. Moore passed away, and then my dad took on the business full time. When I was a teenager, I worked in here on the summers and on the weekends. Went off to college to NC State. Then in 2009, after a career in textiles, Julie returned to help run the family business. A lot of our business does come from word of mouth. Of course, since I've joined, um, I've done a little more online. We have our own web page, and I have a Facebook page and things like that, and that's helped some, but mostly it's word of mouth. Folks around call it, call it the Guff Mall. So then you find anything you want there. So we've sort of got that reputation. We're the place people come to when they don't want to drive to the bigger city to get their parts for their plumbing or their farm or whatever the case may be. Um, the way we've survived, though, is by selling a lot of Carhartt clothing and work clothing, Wrangler, and um, safety boots, work boots, that kind of thing. So even though um, we do serve the local community, what really keeps us alive are people that come from Raleigh, Apex, Greensboro, Sanford, to, to purchase their workwear. I think the secret of this business is having stuff that you don't find in, in the big box stores. Uh, hard to find items. That's what's kept me going. You need a little piece of repair, something to repair some, uh, something around the house. We, most time we've got it here or uh, we've got clothes and shoes that we've been selling for years. And Fan belts to um, plumbing supplies to pork brains is a big seller because they're hard to find. We sell feed wood stoves and windmills, socks. I mean, we just have everything. From radio flyer wagons to rabbit's feet to just about anything you need. And just hard to find items like something simple like a hand chopper for, for ladies in their kitchen. We have them, it's hard to find those at Walmart. So we just have some unique things that the, the big box stores don't have. And if we can buy it local, we try to do so. Um, there are several things in here that are made in North Carolina. There's Patterson Packing Company, which is um, in Sanford. It's only about three or four miles up the road. They do um, they do several brands, but the big brand is Rose. So there's Rose potted meat and Rose pork brains, and um, that's a very popular thing in this area. I think people really enjoy coming here because we have all different kinds of things. I mean, how many places do you go in? You can buy clothing like we have, groceries, even though it's not as much as we used to have, but hoop cheese is a big deal here. We sell a lot of that. Um, my dad collects antiques, and we have some of them for sale, so that's a big draw. I collect uh, wooden storage boxes, shipping boxes, and uh, I've collected churns. I think it's like stepping back in time. Um, I think a lot it takes people back to their childhood, or maybe when they visited their grandparents, they went to a store like ours. And I know there were used to be many in North Carolina, but now there's not so many. So it's a unique experience uh, just to come out and see kind of old-timey store, and that's kind of what we are. So. I think that's what keeps us going and hope it will continue to do so. This is Derek Long for North Carolina Weekend. J.R. Moore and Son is located about six miles north of Sanford, just off Highway 421 at 865 Thrift Road in Gulf. Hours are Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. and Saturday, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. For more information, call 919-898 2998 or visit their website 
at jrmoreson.com.